what's going on guys welcome back to the channel and welcome back to forza horizon 5 here in the winter season of series number three i am back feeling a lot better um still have some irritation on my throat so i might be a little more quiet than normal in these videos uh, but today we're going to start taking on the winter season festival playlist and I spawned in and jumped into this thing and had absolute nightmares of my very last video doing the weekly Forza Thon challenge last week and driving this thing 100 miles so we're gonna go ahead and get out of it I'm gonna go ahead and start up a uh, search for a team for this week's trial grand finale to get a super wheel spin another lame trial but uh, nonetheless Class restriction is Classic Racer, S100, or S900, S1900. Man, I am a little rusty. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and get this started up, and then we'll jump into that car we're going to be using. Alright, and so this is the car that we're going to be using. This is actually going to be my first time driving this car in Horizon 5, but this is the 1965 Shelby Daytona Coupe. This is one of the most expensive, if not the most expensive car in Horizon 5. I don't remember 100%. It's 30 million credits. It's got another 100,000 credits worth of parts thrown onto it. But I've actually got two of these right now in my garage. I've got one that I got in a wheel spin and then one through a seasonal event, either Super 7 or something like that. Uh, but the share code for the tune, along with the tuner's name, will be up on the screen now if you want to check it out as well. So let's go ahead and wait for this matchmaking to start. All right. And our teammates have brought all kinds of different things. Well, not all kinds of different things. I think those are all the same Ferrari. But we'll see how our Shelby can do. Starting out here. I think it was a circuit race to start out with. It sure is. All right. Let's see what we can do. We've got one guy that's in S1, just barely. I'm assuming that Ford Cortina or Cortana, whatever it is, is like the cheapest way to get into the classic racer, I think. So he probably upgraded as much as he could just trying to get into the trial. So let's see what we can do here. I haven't done a trial event in over a week, so maybe we'll have a fresh set of eyes to some of these newer players or less experienced players okay that's not the great start there the team is very much losing as we you know often see come on let's go they're gaining in the pack though that's good to see I haven't played Forza in, oh man, it's been, feels like forever at this point. I don't know the last time that I did play Forza. I really don't. And the fact that the last time I did play it, I was doing the stupid uh, weekly forza -thon challenge of driving 100 miles. It still gives me a little bit of PTSD, so. <clears throat> catch up to the Dravatars up front. I'm trying to push so much right now. I'm definitely faster than our teammate here. I'm trying to give him room too though. Okay, Dravatar just well. Dravatar definitely just lagged out to the right. And then jumped right back in. We got one lap. Oh, we're in second right now. One of our teammates could just help. Come on, let's go. Okay, we've got the win right now. I'm 
We don't have to win no more. Man, come on. This thing does feel really good to drive. I think that if I didn't get run into in that first turn, I probably could have been a little bit more competitive with this guy up front, but just got up in some unkind traffic there. So we're going to get second place. Let's see if our team can pull out a win here. What I should have done there has been a good teammate and tried to fall back and um, slow down some of the Drivatars. Doesn't look like it's going to happen. No. Okay. Well, we go on the race number two. Again, if you haven't done the trial before, you have to win three. Or there's three races. You have to win two of them. Um, if you win the first two, you don't have to do the third. But if you don't, you have to do all three. So we'll see if we can win in race number two. All right. Race number two. We got a sprint race here, so not a circuit. I think circuits are easier to hold the Drivatars up on, but we'll see. We we're down one teammate. We lost him in the last race. Didn't end up helping us at all, but we'll see if we can do something here. I'm starting second to last on the team. In these trial events, your, the players always start behind the Drivatars. So, the closest to pole that we can start is always going to be at least 7th. Okay, we've got positioning. I don't care about the guy up in front. Um, you really need to slow these Dravatars down. guys up. Come on, guys. Our team is really not helping us out here. There is no way that I should be still fighting these guys to at least get one of these other people in front of us. Oh, I think that guy beat us, though. Man. Dang it. I'm out here trying to fight for us. We did win, because we had one of our guys leave, I guess, so we'll take that. Oh my goodness. Alright, on to race number three we go. Hopefully we can pull out a win there. So, tactic worked, I guess. Nonetheless, it helped some of our team get caught back up. Let's see what we get here with the wheel spin. 90,000 credits. Good deal. Let's jump into race number three. Alright, another circuit here. Uh, this one's going to be inside Guana Guanajuato. So we're down to four players. Um, okay, we'll see what we can do here. Hopefully, we, we're starting out at the 
front of the players, the drivers. So let's see if we can't get up in front of the driver's cars fast and maybe slow them down right off the bat. That was just bad driving. <laughs> All right, we've got second and third. And that guy's got no steering. This Dravatar doesn't seem to either, though. Okay, I don't know what happened to our team there. We really fell apart really quick. Oh no. That's not great. Luckily that wasn't like a super fast turn. But we didn't lose too many positions. We're still in it. We're still battling. Gravitars are doing all kinds of just absolutely crazy kind of stuff. Okay, our team's kind of doing kind of crazy kind of stuff too, though. But we losing, we're losing positions like crazy right now. My goodness, guys, come on! No, that's not great. Keep trying to dive into that turn. He's really not working out for us though. Okay, I think I need to just let him go. I really gotta do some work and the Dravatar is behind us. Where's our team even at? Oh my goodness. Oh yeah, we're definitely not going to win this one. So I'll be doing this again. I'll see you guys here in a second because I won't record doing the entire championship again. I'll just show you at the end of the results. <sighs> Emotional damage! All right, there we go. I think we're gonna win this on our second attempt here on the trial. I sure hope so. We should, we had third, fourth, and fifth, I think, so. There we go, we should, we got it, so. Whew. I'm glad that I only had to do it twice. It's really dumb that I had to do it twice, but nonetheless, we got it done on the second try. This father of doom guy didn't... I'd, I'm pretty sure he DNF'd all three races. Like, come on. Alright, there we go. So that will get the blue team wins and gets us super fun reward of the super wheel spin. Alright, but there we go. That is the grand finale trial event done here in the winter season of series number three. Um, that's really not... One of my favorite ways to come back to Forza um, after, you know, taking some time off due to being sick, having to do the trial twice is definitely not a fun way to start it out, but we got the hardest out of the way, so now we'll just have 
the seasonal events and the other little random things that aren't near as difficult as the trial. So I hope you guys did enjoy the video or found it helpful. If you did, definitely leave a like on the video. Definitely get subscribed for future Forza Horizon 5 content just like this. But other than that, I do hope you have a great rest of your day and we will see you in the next video.